Tomorrow, Governor Greg Abbott is presenting an award to a North Texas police officer who was nearly killed in the line of duty. The Grapevine motorcycle officer went through two years of grueling rehab to get back to the job he loves. Our Caroline Vandergriff picks up the story from there. RJ Hudson has always loved motorcycles. He's been riding one for more than two decades in his career as a police officer. You're able to get places that cars can't go. In 2017, Hudson was trying to pull someone over for a traffic violation on 121 when an SUV swerved into his lane. I was doing approximately 95 miles an hour when I got hit. And Hudson skidded down the roadway nearly 300 feet. I've been an accident investigator for a long time and I've never worked a crash to this severity with somebody's living to tell about it. I had 26 different broken bones into hundreds of different pieces. It took two years, nearly a dozen surgeries, and countless hours of physical therapy before Hudson returned to full duty and to his motorcycle. I had a goal of getting back on a motorcycle and coming back out and competing in events like this. More than 100 officers from police departments across the country are in Grapevine for agility competitions this Friday and Saturday. The Back to Blue Rodeo is meant to be fun for the public to watch, but it's also a critical training opportunity for these officers. They can practice riding with precision under pressure. Everything being on a stopwatch adds a lot of stress. Hudson credits the skills the rodeo develops with helping save his life. Officers need to uh, trust in themselves and, and have perseverance and push through, and then uh, training is important. He's grateful to be here and has no plans to stop riding anytime soon. I'm completely blessed. In Grapevine, Caroline Vandergriff, CBS 11 News. We welcome you back, officer. By the way, the governor is going to be presenting the Star of Texas Award to Officer Hudson, 1030 tomorrow morning. They'll do that in Austin. It honors first responders who were seriously injured or, in some cases, killed in the line of duty.